days of school are we at? 135. 135 looks like this. It's a 100. 30. It's 30. And 5. And 5. When I put 30 with 100, I get 130. When I put 5 with it, I get 135. What's one more? 136. 136 stands for 100. The 3 in 136 stands for 30. And the 6 in 136 stands for 6. Who can guess my covered number? Dylan, what's my covered number? 43. What was your strategy that you used to figure that out? I counted up down from 44. Okay, so tell me what you said. 44, 43. Okay, perfect. What was his strategy? Counting Counting backwards. backwards. Counting backwards. Who had a different strategy? Um, Maya C. I did 3, 13, 23, 33. What was Maya's strategy? Counting by 10. I didn't count it. 42. So you, tell me what you said. 42, 43. What was her strategy? Counting forward. Counting forward. She started her number track at 42. And then what? They're here. Five. Five. How many five. white beads? Five. Five and five is? Ten. Ten. So we know there's going to be ten beads, right? Mm -hmm. Who can raise their hand and tell me how many beads are here? Riley. Seven. What was your strategy to figure out that was seven? I saw five red and then um um and then I saw two reds. You two saw five reds and two whites. Whites. And you just knew that five and two is seven. Seven. Okay. So now that we have established there's seven beads showing, I want you to tell me how many beads are hiding. Raise your hand. Kelly, how many beads are hiding? Three. Three. <clears throat> what was your strategy to figure that out? I put seven up and then I saw three down. Let's try Callie's strategy. Put seven fingers up. And how many fingers are down? Three. 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 Who had a different strategy than Callie's? Annabelle, what was your strategy? Um, I, I put, um, I put ten up and then t took away two. Then I took away the five and I saw that that was three. Okay, so let's try Annabelle's. Put up ten, flash ten. She took away her five red, and then she took away her two white. And she saw what fingers she had up. She had three fingers up. Good job. Take a look at the numeral six and all the partners that make six. First, I'm going to write the numeral six. It looks like this. Now I want you to get your hands ready and tell me the sounds you hear in six. Six. So I heard you say six. The first sound in six is hook, snake around. What's the next sound in six? Yeah. Small down, dot, s. And that last sound in six? Slant, cross, Okay, I'm going to draw spheres today. How many spheres have I drawn? Zero. 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 I need, and how many do I need to draw? Six. Six. Well, I can write that as an equation. So can you help me? Six equals zero plus six. I need Madison to go show me that on the board. While she's doing that, I want you to think about what the switch partner of that would be. You guys can show me that bunny ears too. Can you show bunny ears? have I drawn now? Three. How many more do I need to draw? Three. Three. <clears throat> Can you help me write that equation? Three. Charlie, what do you notice about that equation? 
It does equal 6. Is there anything else we know about 3 plus 3? Callie. It's doubles. It's a doubles. Yep. Um, Charlie, can you go show me that on the board here? Let's give him a yeehaw. Yeehaw! Charlie, Charlie did a good job.